Relatives of two women murdered by an off-duty sheriff's deputy are suing now for $8 million. They say the sheriff's office ignored warning signs. Gwen Local 6 reporter Carla Castaño joins us live. And Carla, these families are blaming the sheriff's office for the killings. That's right, Alexis. This lawsuit alleges that the sheriff, the county, and two top aides knew that the man was dangerously unstable. The wrongful death lawsuit filed yesterday claims Sheriff Craig Roberts and the other defendants knew Sergeant Jerry Grone was a threat to his wife, Charlotte. The lawsuit also alleges officials knew Grone was emotionally unsteady, angry, depressed, and had substance abuse problems. In February of 2010, a drunken grown confronted his wife and two of her friends at a Gresham lounge. He pulled his wife outside and shot her in the head, then returned and shot Victoria Schulmerich and Kathleen Hoffmeister. The sergeant then committed suicide. The attorneys representing the family say the cover-up went all the way to the top of the Clackamas County Sheriff's Office. They not only did nothing to prevent this from happening, they actively intervened when the Portland police were investigating the domestic violence allegations against him and told the Portland police not to give the Clackamas County District Attorney that information. The Schulmerich and Hoffmeister families are each seeking $3.5 million for loss and pain and suffering. The families are also asking for almost $1 million more in lost earning and expenses. Meanwhile, a spokesperson for the Clackamas County Sheriff's Office says that they can't comment on the lawsuit. Reporting for you live in downtown Portland, Carla Castaño, Coin Local 6.